Ronaldo News Now. Loss in Saudi Super Cup semifinals due to sending off of Cristiano Ronaldo after a four-minute elbow on Ali Albulehi in the Saudi Super Cup semifinal. Cristiano Ronaldo received a straight red card. Cristiano Ronaldo's exciting encounter ended in a red card in the waning minutes of a heated Saudi Super Cup semifinal match between Al Nasser and Al Hilal. Ronaldo had elbowed an opponent. Al Hilal won 2 to 1 despite losing Ronaldo to a red card just as his team was about to take a commanding lead, although Al Nasser scored a late consolation goal. The match ended in a red card for Ronaldo for an elbow on Ali Albalehi. Jorge Jesus, coach of Al Hilal, claimed that Ronaldo is unable to accept losing since he is so used to winning. As an inspiration to many, Ronaldo is among the world's most influential players, but he has never lost in his professional career, so it's understandable that he would lose his composure and emotional and mental stability when he suffers a loss, playing against the top central defenders in Saudi football, like Kalidou Koulibaly of Al Hilal and Al Balehi, is no picnic. It's no secret that Ronaldo is still one of the best players in the world, I won't say anything negative about him. He's a role model and an inspiration. As soon as Ronaldo saw the red card, he seemed to make a punching motion toward the referee, who had already turned away from the 3 9 year old NA social media post. Al Nasser voiced their disapproval of the decision and implied that the result of the game was already certain, you can't alter the outcome of a previously resolved matter the club stated on social media. Much obliged to our passionate followers, because the red card was unnecessary, Al Nasser coach Luis Castro said that video assistant referees should have stepped in. The incident that resulted in Ronaldo's red card is difficult to discuss, Castro stated, based on what we've seen this season, Ronaldo wasn't involved in any incidents that warranted a red card. Al Balehi, the opposing player, feigned injury, Neither Cristiano nor the opposing defender made much of a physical connection. He made a big fuss, and the video assistant referee should have brought in the official to go over the sending off. Ronaldo and Al Nasser will likely finish the season without any hardware after this loss. They have lost all of their domestic cup and Asian Champions League matches and now sit 12 points behind league leaders Al Hilal with only seven games remaining in the season and the 62nd minute. Serge Milinkovic Savic set up a quick counterattack for Al Hilal, and Salem Al Dasari calmly placed the ball into the bottom corner to give his team the lead. Malcolm, a Brazilian attacker, found himself unguarded in the area after capitalizing on a pinpoint cross from Michael in the 72nd minute. He then extended Al Hilal's advantage with a well placed header. Sadio Main, a former Liverpool star, scored a late equalizer for Al Nasser off a pass from Abdul Rahman Garib against all the odds against them. Unfortunately for Al Nasser, their late rally was not enough to prevent Al Hilal from advancing to the final, and the upcoming final, Al Hilal will take against Al Ittihad, captained by Karim Benzema, with the goal of extending their record to four titles, and the other semi-final, Al Ittihad advanced to the final by defeating Al Weda 2-1. Now, two strong clubs will face off in a thrilling final for the Saudi Super Cup trophy.